I'm now going to bring out a special guest. He's an artist, and his name is Bren Bataclan. Bren? Welcome, buddy. Thanks for having me back. Thanks for having me back. And I also <laughs> grabbed the mic from you. This time. <laughs> yes, in rehearsal, he grabbed the mic, and I said, do not grab my microphone. <laughs> Now, Bren, you're an artist, and you, uh, you came on our show, and we loved your story because what you do is you want to make people smile. Mm -hmm. So Bren creates art of smiling faces and leaves it all around the Boston area with a note, and on the note it says, you can have this art for free if you promise to smile more often. Now, Bren, why do you do this? Um, I just want to make folks happy. So, and, um, and I, <laughs> thank you. So. <laughs> And there's some on his seats, and there's one big one that no one has claimed back there, so. <laughs> so he's actually put art tonight in this building, and if you find it and read the note, you can take it. Yeah. Now, you said there's a real big one in the back somewhere? Yeah, it's right next to that guy over there. See, oh yeah, he took it, finally! <laughs> he's been staring at it for a while, see, there's... Yeah. I still have my painting, and it's in my room, and it makes me smile, Bren. Thank you. I thank you for that. Now, you were off in Belize. What were you doing out there? Uh, I was leaving paintings on Mayan temples and giving them a wild man. But yeah, it's just leaving paintings all over Belize. Now, now, how does an artist get funding for something like this? Because you do it all over the world. Yeah, um, I don't leave all the paintings. Some, some, sometimes family and friends leave them for me, but I was in Belize. So I left them there. So. Now, how far has your art gone across the globe? Um, it's gone as far as Antarctica. So, yeah, uh, it's been left about 30 countries and about 25 different states. So I'll be in San Francisco um, this July because, well, it's my um, big exhibit at UMass Boston will, will now be shown in San Francisco. So I'll leave paintings there in my, oh, thank you. And I'll, thank you. Now I'm thinking that maybe the paintings that you put in Antarctica to make people smile should probably be like the sun. Yeah, actually someone left it on a penguin colony and no one took it, <laughs> so they actually grabbed it back and placed it on the ship. And I'll be, um, uh, The penguins didn't want it. What was wrong with those penguins? Yeah, they're always yeah. in tuxedos, I know. Yeah, but they're, well, they're happy already, so, yeah. Not, yeah. They better be, yeah. the March of the Penguins. Yeah. Let me ask you now, any shows coming up for you in Boston if people want to see your art? Yeah, um, well, my, my um, show at the Harbor Art Gallery is uh, still up, and it's about the Philippine flood that happened last October, and um, proceeds from that um, will go to the Philippine flood victim, folks that were like affected by the um, earthquakes in Haiti and um, Chile, and, and over like $1,000 have, have been raised so far. Fantastic folks, Bren Bataclan, what an artist. All right, we'll be right back with more of our first anniversary spectacular right after this. Thank you, Bren. Thank you very much. Bro. That was great.